Hello, hello everybody. How are you? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to my channel. I am Teresa. This is my channel, Just Teresa. I'm just taking a second to show you all how to make a custom emoji using Canva. Um, that's what I use. It's really the only program that I, I've learned a little bit along the way. So I just decided I would come in here and teach you guys what I know when I know it. So if you haven't subscribed, do me a favor and go ahead and subscribe. Please hit the bell and give me a thumbs up on this video. The bell is good, so whenever I come on, you'll know it because I'm going to be doing more tutorials and I have so much other stuff going on on my channel, you wouldn't want to miss that. So please subscribe, hit the bell, give me a thumbs up, leave me comments and let me know if this is helpful for you. If you have any questions, you can go ahead and hit me on Instagram. All my information is down below. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, you guys, I'm on my Canva account. This is my personal Canva account. This is where you want to be, okay? So for you, you're going to hit create design, and then you're going to see a drop down that's going to give you the option of custom dimensions. You want to hit that. But because I've already used that and I'm already a Canva user, mine has custom size right here. Okay, so I don't have to do that. If you don't have Canva, it is free. So just go ahead and create an account. So I'm going to hit custom size and right there, this is where it's very important. You want the width and the height to be the right width and the height for a small custom emoji. You can use it for, um, for, um, uh, what you call, um, little icons as well. So the custom width is going to be 41 and the custom height height is also going to be 41. That's what you want to put there. 41, 41. Then you can hit create design. So now it's going to pull up this little box. This is the size already made for you because you put the 4141 in. Then you want to go over here. Um, then you want to uh, create new design. So that's what we're going to do. Now we're going to click right over here on the right. On the left hand side, we're going to hit background. Because we want to pick a background for this. Um, it is It is recommended to do... A light colored background okay so let me see what we can do something fun and playful I'm gonna do this pink one and also look for free okay there's a lot of free ones you don't have to pick the pros if you don't need to see all of these are free so you want to get a light one I thought this pink water splash was pretty cute so I have that there it's already stretched out for the size of the box it's already made all right so that's the background i want to use then i want to go back over here we're going to hit elements we're going to look for elements right there so we're hitting elements next all right so now let's find the element that will be fun i think i, I already got one that says let's dance so what about i like to do let's do a drink one I have a segment because I am a um because I am a licensed bartender. I have a segment on my channel called Sipping and Small Talk. So I already have an icon for that one, but this is uh I'm gonna do another one just for the sake of the video. All right, so let's see. Uh let's see something fun that we can do. That's pro, so that means it's gonna charge you. You don't want to get charged. We want to look for the free ones, okay? So this is also free and it might stand out a little better on the yellow. All right. What do y'all think about that? I think that's cute. So we'll leave that there. The next thing you want to do is expand it. You always want to make sure you expand it in the box as wide as you can because the emojis come out very small. So now we're going to go over here to the left hand side and we're going to hit text. And you kind of want to just give it a fun little name, whatever it is that you want. I think cheers actually is, is appropriate for this. So we're going to try cheers. I don't need this part. I'm going to hit delete. But this cheers, let me spread it out. This cheers is in white. I, do, I mean in black. I definitely don't want it to be in black. So I'm going to hit white. Let's see. Oh, you can't see that either. Okay, let me think of another color. Hold on. And for the colors, you just go back and you change the color. 
All right, so here we're gonna change the color. Let's see if yellow works. And you just you just have to play with it. So the yellow doesn't work either. Let me see if we can put pink letters. Nope, nope, I don't like that. So as you can see, you need to play with this. You gotta play with it. Let me try black. I didn't think black worked before. Um, it's not bad, but we'll go with it. All right, so you got cheers. That's what we want. We'll try to put it on right in the middle. How about that? What do y'all think? I think that is super cute. So it's all about playing with your text, playing with your elements, and playing with your background. You make it what you want to make it. Then you hit download. And we want to leave it in PNG. And then you just hit download. And there you go. It's telling me that it is all set. Download. Here it is. And you see how tiny that is? That's how it is when you use custom emojis when you're monetized. So it's just going to be this little thing. But you still rather have your custom emojis than to have the emojis. You know, it's good to know how to make your own instead of having um, the ones that YouTube gives you. You know what I'm saying? So this is my channel. If you're not subscribed, it should definitely look like that. I have the butterfly. The butterfly is my symbol. Yellow is my favorite color. So you'll see that a lot. And you'll see my um, picture right there. I hope you decide to go ahead and become family. And I hope this is helpful for you. You guys have a great day. Bye.